Most people recognize David Beckham as an amazing football player, having played for the best clubs in the world, such as Manchester United, Real Madrid, and AC Milan. Even if you haven't seen him play, you'll still likely know something about him. Whether it's his charity work, marriage to former Spice Girl Victoria Beckham, or even his associations with many brands, most people know his name. However, people still ignore certain things about him. Watch the video to find out 10 things you didn't know about David Beckham. Number 10. $250 million insurance body Coming in at number 10 is this shocking fact. Apparently, David Beckham doesn't cut any corners when it comes to securing his future. He has a staggering $250 million insurance policy for his body. He took it out back in 2006. At the time, he made headlines for having history's biggest sports-related insurance policy taken out. Several companies had to get involved due to the unbelievable magnitude of the policy. In case you're curious, it includes his money makers, his legs, feet, toes, and handsome looks in case of an accident that disfigures him or took away his ability to make money. Number 9. He has 74 tattoos Everyone knows that Beckham has a not-so-secret love for tattoos, but do you know how many tattoos he has in total? The answer is 74 though you would never know how many he's likely to add in the future. His tattoos range from religious and renaissance artwork to lettering and cursive and iconography choices. They also include the names of all his children, Brooklyn, Romeo, Harper, Cruz, tributes to his wife, a tattoo of a ship, one that his father also has, and the number 32, which was his jersey number back when he played for Milan. Number 8. He was dubbed a sports minister Imagine a world that had David Beckham as Britain's sports minister. That was almost a reality in 2013 when there was a cabinet reshuffle. It was George Osborne who suggested adding the football star to the DAP government role. Ultimately, he was cut because other officials didn't think he would hold up under the pressure of the demanding job or be able to stand in the House of Lords dispatch box and discuss government policy on sports. Number 7. He considers himself Jewish Not many fans know that the legendary footballer considers himself Jewish. He stated before that his grandfather on his mother's side was Jewish. And although he was never brought up Jewish, he loved it every time they went to synagogue. In his autobiography, he said that he's also had more contact with Judaism than any other religion. Number 6. He played in several movies When he's not breaking sports records, Beckham is actually pretty interested in the film industry. He's played an impressive number of roles on the big screen and on TV. At the beginning of his career, he started out by taking roles in advertisements, appearing in ads for the likes of PepsiCo and Adidas. Eventually, he was able to play himself and make cameos. You can find him in the Goal series, the 2015 film The Man from UNCLE, the short film Outlaws, and the 2017 film King Arthur, A Legend of the Sword. Number 5. He has set up a foundation looking after disabled kids. When he's not making iconic cameos, playing football, designing, or traveling the world with his wife and children, David Beckham's heart is dedicated to philanthropic causes. In 2005, David and his wife, Victoria Beckham, set up the Victoria and David Beckham Children's Charity, which is dedicated to raising money to buy state-of-the-art wheelchairs and disability resources for disabled children. By now, his foundation has raised over 1 million euros so far. That's not the extent of his philanthropic efforts, though. Beckham is a UNICEF ambassador and supports the Unite Against AIDS campaign and helps for heroes, save the children, and a large number of other incredible organizations. Number 4. You can get a degree on Beckham Studies Do you consider yourself the ultimate David Beckham fan? Then answer this, do you have a degree in Beckham Studies? That's right, you can get a degree dedicated to your favorite midfielders. The university that provides this iconic degree for the man who's earned the title of the world's highest paid player is Staffordshire University. When the course first launched, the number of fans applying to the 12-week course was overwhelming. The course is offered to sports science, sociology, and media study students. Number 3. He's one of the biggest brands in Japan Not many footballers can say that they're as big as Samsung or Coca-Cola in Japan, but David Beckham has always been iconic. It's said that he's so dramatically popular and influential that he can change Japan's fashion overnight, even if it's just with a haircut. His marriage to Spice Girl Victoria Beckham doesn't hurt either. A marketing study in Tokyo found that Beckham was the city's most well-liked male foreigner in TV ads. 
He is able to sell anything from clothing lines and phones to motor oil. One Japanese confectionery company even once built him a chocolate statue. Number 2. He named his children after where they were conceived. The world eagerly waited every time the Beckhams announced they were expecting a new child, even if it was just to find out what one-of-a-kind name the newest Beckham was about to get. People were surprised when they named their first son Brooklyn. Their reasoning behind the name? It's where the couple conceived him. Victoria isn't shy about stating that she's always liked the boroughs of Brooklyn. It's also where she found out she was pregnant. Number 1. He has OCD Our number one fact about David Beckham you didn't know about the star is that he has OCD. It originally wasn't something he confessed to the public. Eventually, he admitted that his obsessive compulsive disorder has him constantly rearranging hotel rooms to make everything perfect. As soon as he walks in, he moves all the books and leaflets and puts them away in a drawer, as well as lines up all cans of soft drinks, even going as far as throwing one away to have an even number. Victoria Beckham has also spoken about his OCD, saying that they have three fridges at home, one for food, another for salads, and a third for drinks. What do you think of these surprising facts? Which one shocked you the most? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel Celeb Space and turn on notifications.